Spotted lanternflies have entered Pennsylvania, causing quite a stir. A quarantine was put in place earlier this year in areas with active infestations like Luzerne, Carbon, and Monroe County. But in Lackawanna County... An individual, will say, was found, and so we know it was there. But that doesn't necessarily mean there is an infestation. Where they find spotted lanternfly but don't find an active infestation, it's because spotted lanternfly was carried there. The reason why we have the problem that we do with spotted lanternfly is because this insect is a phenomenal hitchhiker. They can hitchhike as egg masses. Nymphs or adults can travel by hopping on vehicles. Currently, the spotted lanternflies are in their immature phase and cannot yet fly, but Corman says it's important to eradicate the bugs in all phases because it's an invasive species that is impacting our agriculture. For instance, while they can't kill trees, the more that um, insects that are feeding on the trees um, and the more stressed trees become, then they become susceptible to other, other pathogens and other insect infestations in the environment. That's not all the bugs can do. They also excrete honeydew. When honeydew covers the leaves of plants, then it causes sooty mold to grow on the leaves of plants, and that inhibits photosynthesis. A report published in December states the economic impact of spotted lanternflies on agriculture and forestry is estimated at about $50 million per year, with a loss of 484 jobs. Corman recommends if you see a spotted lanternfly, report it by calling the spotted lanternfly hotline. She also says people should check their vehicles while traveling through quarantine zones. And if you want to kill them, some people trap them using, you know, they might put sticky traps on tape or tape or sticky tra traps, sorry, on trees, or they might use um, another trapping device called a circle trap uh, on trees to catch, collect, and destroy them. Um, some people just swat them. Corman says the important thing is for people to do whatever they can to get rid of the bugs. Ravithi Janaswamy, Eyewitness News.